Welcome back, survivors. I'm the survival of this, and we are turning to Colt Canyon. We're going to hop into a new run with the new character we opened up last episode. Uh, we basically just tried the game out for the first time, quite enjoyed what it had on offer and play. Uh, the premise is pretty simple. You're just a gunslinger who has their partner kidnapped by a group of bandits, and then you got to go chase after and try to rescue them. Uh, no. Oh. oh, actually, you get to choose... Oh, wow. Okay, I didn't realize that you could actually choose from a variety of weapons along with the gunslinger as, like, your basic one to go with. That's pretty neat. So we're going to go for Buck Stab Brewer here, who uses a bird shotgun, and see how we fare. Now, I don't know if the tutorial is going to be the only time where you start off with, like, no health or just... Oh, yeah, that seems to be the case. Now we have full health at the top left there. Yeah, so let me just break all this to try to get some... Uh, I'm not going to worry too much about picking up those broken bottles. Oh, I guess... Oh, I guess they're just counted as... Oh, no, they do count as, like, a weapon slot. It just automatically picked them like, up, I guess, because I didn't have any, uh... Any other weapon in the secondary slot. Ow. Okay, I gotta remember, this is single shot, so... I remember, with Western Days, we want something that has... Yeah, you know what, I think I am going to uh, change off the screen shake, because that can be... It can be a little distracting in certain spots to have that going off. Okay, I thought I... Okay, let me double check that, because I thought... Okay, so... I guess that's just the way the camera is with the, uh... Settings there. Because I was going to say, like, it feels like it's really jittery as I'm trying to walk around a little bit. Alright, let's help you out. And to do reduce weapon cooldowns, allowing you to shoot faster. Healing companions is cheaper. I don't... I haven't, I haven't even actually found companion yet. More dynamite, deal more melee damage. Or take one on your side. I think I'm going to go for hip fire, though. And I do see the horse freaking out, so I wonder if there's a way to... Uh, no way to calm it down, and I'm not going to melee it, because I have a feeling I know what's going to happen if I do that. Now, the bird shotgun, if all pellets do hit a target, it puts them down pretty well. But it's also got the chance that it will just uh, clip things, too. Ooh. Uh oh. Oh. I thought I took down the horse, but I guess maybe I just freed it from. Uh, whatever it was tied to. Yeah, you ain't getting away there. Okay, there we go. Get some more rounds. Now I've taken a little bit of damage. I think the most powerful weapons in the game are likely going to be the ones that have a high capacity for ammunition to fire out. Oh, there you go. I figure let's just try to set them loose. I don't need to harm them in any way. They're just kind of getting caught in the crossfire if they don't. There's that. Yeah, this area is all cleared out. I'll just wrap it there. I wonder if I, 
Maybe I should just try following the train tracks whenever I'm on a level, because it does seem like uh, they have been kind of looping around to a few areas. Ooh, careful. Oh. All right, gotta be careful of the dogs. Sorry there, Fido, but you are not exactly friendly to me. Yeah, I'd love to try to find another rifle. There's a few more rounds there, but those are more for the revolver. And though it does have a fight, uh, high amount that can fire out and high firing rate, it is kind of wimpy. It doesn't have a nice impact to its shots. See, I'll just... Oh, there's some enemies. There we go. They're taken care of. Uh, do, 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 do. Crate there. Just has a round in it. Another round there. Yeah, this looks like we only have two rounds for the uh, bird shotgun, so we're going to want to stick to the revolver for a while. And looks like that is the level's end. Okay, let's get to the next. Let's see if we can get ourselves either some nicer upgrades or try to get some more ammunition. There we go, there's a couple more for the bird shotgun. A few more shells. Oh. Take care of you. Oh, you have an axe, but you never really want to take a knife to a gunfight, so we'll probably want to avoid the melee weapons a lot. Take those, take those. That explosive barrel will leave behind. Oh, there's a crate. A few more shells. No, I hear somebody tied up. Take care of you. I think they're down that way more. Yeah, I gotta be very careful of the dogs. They close distance quick. So I should put them as high type uh, high priority. Okay, another shot or another round. Oh, there you ooh. Glad I didn't shoot too much around here. Okay. Carry additional ammo for equipped weapons. Increase pickup range for items. Restore one HP every new level and every couple dozen kills. Let me fight or shell weapons. I think I'll go for the shell weapons. I still hasn't got a companion yet just because I don't feel like I've gotten myself even with a decent enough load. Hello. That's not a bad find. It's probably just like the shotgun was uh, last episode we played with, but... That should mean it has more impact. And who does it ever? Ow. Oh, I actually took him down with a melee hit. I gotta be careful when it comes to the reload. I think I'm... Actually, one thing I should try is when I am reloading... If I can just click with the mouse when it looks like it's to the point for... I can. Oh, that's... I like that intu intuitive design. So I thought you had to uh, press R to reload when you get to, like, the active zone. But the game does let you just click again as if to shoot. So I'm going to be able to hit those active reloads much more easily now. Oh, you've got a shield. No wonder why you're uh, sticking around so long. Ow. 
Ow. Okay, I don't know how I'm going to get through the shield, because... Oh. Okay, shield is something I'll have to try to figure out a way to get around. I don't know if I have to melee hit it to try to, like, break it. But yeah, we actually got... Didn't make as much progress that one. But we did unlock a new character, so we'll try hopping in with them and seeing. But I don't know... Unless maybe I have to try to dodge through them and then attack back? Try doing a run with permadeath disabled. Um, we'll try Machia Eagle May. Extra arrow damage, crazy agile, not great with guns. A small bow and a few different types of weapons that they can take. So we'll try them out because I am a bit of an archery nut. And see how they feel in a game like this. Now, my thing would be the arrows, maybe by their nature, they're easy to recover after you've taken something out. Okay, it... Okay, I gotta be careful how close I let things get. I gotta remember, I've got the dodge roll. I should use it. Yeah, so as long as you have a sneak attack, you will basically be guaranteed with the bow to take somebody down. But it doesn't look like you do pick up more arrows from anybody you take out. Oh, maybe I'm mistaken, because those two I did just get. Okay, pocket pistol. That's not going to be all that handy, but I guess it's better than nothing. Yeah, that's reloaded, that's reloaded. I guess melee build might be more viable as we're running around, because, like, depending on the character, you can get some decent speed built up. Yeah, I find all kinds of... I wonder if I can only have ten arrows at a time. Maybe not. I guess just the... I was just looking at the top left there. It looks like there's a bit of a darker background behind whatever weapon I you have selected at the time. Yeah, this one is so quick, I don't even think I really have to worry too much about the active reload on it. Oh, nope. There we go. There we go. Okay, so I'm out of arrows, but we can help them out. Ah, healing companions is cheaper. What is the arrow? Find more items in containers. I might have to go for that one. Light ammo weapons shoot double the... Ooh. I'll, I... No, I have to go for more items, because I definitely need to get more... I'm going to use the bow. I need to get more arrows for it at all. Okay, at least there's another arrow there. I can find all kinds of rounds of ammo for guns and such. I'm not getting so lucky when it comes to... One arrow right now, but I definitely want more. Take care of you. 
And it looks like everything is calmed down around here now, so I can do a little bit of scavenging to see. There we go. Try and go for melee to save the ammo, but might as well just take it out if we can. Oh, here we go. Uh, yeah, I think, yeah, I probably just looped around here. Okay, I think that's this level cleared out. So we'll work our way forward and see what else we can go up against. And yeah, what happens if I... Oh, okay, you're actually a friendly... Well, I shouldn't say friendly, but you're not going to be hostile and attack me, so I can just leave you be. So some dogs... Yeah, some of the dogs, I guess when they're comp uh, with enemies, are like trained to attack you back, so you have to mind that. But others are just roaming about in the world, and you can just meet them. What is that? A hoe. Nah, I don't think we'll go for a hoe. Now let's go to the next level. Aside from the low arrow count, I do like the character. Very speedy. The bow is very nice for how quickly it uh, cycles through its shots. They are a bit weak for their shots, but there might be more powerful bows to find that will like help offset. Oh, there's another arrow. Okay. That's a little bit better. And let's see. Take care of you too. Some more arrows. Stuck there. Yeah, I'm taking some dumb uh, hits just because of not reacting fast enough to what's going on. Ow, darn it, dog. up the active reload. I gotta... Okay, yeah, I've taken a lot more damage than I really should have. Hopefully I can try to find a little bit of uh, health somewhere. Oh, there we go. Got a little bit there. Sounds like there is another uh, tied-up prisoner. Take care of you. Right, no arrows. We've got to rely on the revolver for now. Okay, snag that. I'd like to try to find better guns, but so far, I haven't had too much luck of that yet. Okay, well, we've got more arrows, so we'll probably use that for... ...while forward. I definitely want to... Tr okay, there's the uh, prisoner. Yeah, I'll help them in just a moment. Truth be told, I don't know if I am actually finding more ammo or more items in containers, or it's just I'm finding all the ammo I can't use. There you are. Okay, so what could we get? Increased pickup range, not really that helpful. Immune negative status effects I haven't really run into. 
Wolves and Dine might start fires. Increase... I guess maybe I'll go for the companion. You take the boomerang. Oh, okay. Um. Here, can you take the small revolver? There we go. Hmm, interesting. Okay, there we go. Right, I'm... Okay, giving him the revolver. Handy in some regard if I kept arrows for myself and had a weapon. So, shoot. I might have to go melee, actually. Oh, you can... Okay. Okay. So I can assign them to, like, attack here or go there and do this. So they're... It's not just an escort. You do have... They are... Ah, uh, there's some input in that you have for them. Okay, that's good to know. Oh, uh-oh. Oh. Oh, yeah. Okay. As much as I like the bow... It feels like you do not find enough ammo for it at all, so I'll probably next episode go back to our uh, first character we tried and go further with them. But yeah, if I could have gotten enough arrows to keep us going, it would have been nice to try, but it feels like that is the hardest one to find the ammo for. But for now, I think we have a good spot to end this episode of Cold Canyon. End. Trying some new things, seeing some new stuff, and hopefully we'll start making some more progress soon. But thank you guys for joining me on this episode of the series. If you did like the video, be sure to give it a like, and if you have any comments, tips, or tricks, put in the comments right down below. And until I see you all in the next video or episode of Survivors, please remember, as always, to take care and stay alive.